A European passenger plane flying from Barcelona, Spain to Dusseldorf, Germany has crashed in southern France. The plane was an Airbus A320, operated by German wings and lost contact in the French Alps around noon local time. The plane reportedly had 144 passengers aboard and six crew members. In a press conference, a German wing spokesperson announced the plane began an unexpected descent shortly after reaching cruising altitude 40 minutes into the flight. The spokesperson said the airline believes there were 67 German nationals on board but couldn't confirm the nationalities of all passengers, despite reports of Spanish and Turkish nationals. The plane, we understand, has crashed in the high Alps, in the French Alps. I mean, we're talking about a mountainous region, which clearly would make them... Um, any uh, rescue operations more complicated. French President Francois Hollande said during a speech all on board the flight are feared dead. Spanish Prime Minister Mariano Rajoy made his own speech saying he suspended his schedule and is working with French and German authorities in the investigation. Lufthansa's CEO, which owns German Wings, released a statement on Twitter saying, My deepest sympathy goes to the families and friends of our passengers and crew on 4U9525. If our fears are confirmed, this is a dark day for Lufthansa. We hope to find survivors. For Newsy, I'm Matt Moreno.